Wow, it's just the exact perfect time to start the vlog. So good morning, guys. I hope you all doing great. I hope you are smiling because as you know, it's a new day. A new smile. I, I, I did this like before I I did like this. Whoa, whoa, did you saw this bird? Oh my god, it's so dope. So, uh, like, I did this before I just winked with my eyes, so yeah, it's pretty f***ed up, but yeah. Good morning, guys, my name is Elibox, if you don't know me. I'm a daily vlogger, I do stupid random craps, and I also always show my sunsets that I see from my rooftop, because this is the most lit and amazing view dude that you've ever seen, boy. Oh my god. Oh my god, I ran out of fire. So yeah, we got here the beautiful clouds, we got a beautiful sunset And another thing, if you don't know me and if you are not already subscribed Then first of all guys, go smash that subscribe button I'm not gonna tell you to leave a like, but wait for the end of the vlog and then you can smash that like button as well. Now another thing, I'm a photographer. Besides me being a vlogger, I also do videography and photography and a lot of IG cool shots. So here's my Instagram link. You can go check out my photos. I do some pretty dope photos and a lot of edits. So a lot of you guys ask me how I create my photos and how I do them. I think I'm gonna explain to you in this vlog how I do this. You see, we got here a dope ass beautiful sunset. Now this is an exact perfect time for me, golden hour, to do a dope pictures for my Instagram account. I have no idea what I'm gonna record that. I didn't thought about it, I just saw the sunset and, then, and I told myself, damn, this is going to be a dope picture from this. Now, the first thing I'm gonna need is a model. 99% of the time, I got my beautiful friends that I have to model for me or I model the photos by myself and Ariel takes the pictures and then I do the edit. We're just gonna go and bring my friend Yana, which came to me and we're gonna do some dope shots on the rooftop. One eternity later. So guys, we got to my rooftop. Here's Diana behind me. Um, yeah, in a zoom on her. The sunset is already passed because I was ready for freaking Diana to come to the rooftop, and she took too long, so we missed the sunset. So basically, the idea of that I had already was ruined. So I'm gonna improvise a bit and do a footage right over where Diana stands. Afterwards, I'm gonna go to my computer and edit something. But at least I'm gonna have a bunch of photos already prepared so that I can edit them later. Eventually. Okay, guys. So we got some beautiful shots over here. We got music playing in the back. Background and special thanks to Yana, the model, the beautiful girl that you see behind me. We got some pretty blow past pictures and we're gonna edit them later when we get off this rooftop. Okay guys, so we are in the computer right now. Uh, I got my computer right over here and I uh, got the camera over here and let's just do just it. So in this video, I'm gonna explain to you how I edit most of my photos. And um, First of all, I take them as you saw earlier and afterwards I import them to my computer. As you see right now, I got all the photos right over here. I'm just gonna pick one of them. We got some dope pictures over here. They don't look so well right now, but after we're gonna edit them, we're gonna look dope and after we're gonna import them to the Lightroom We're gonna edit the colors and everything and it's gonna look a lot more doper I picked a few photos and I think that we're gonna edit this picture that we took It now looks not so well, but I'm gonna use that So we just take it um, and we import it to the Photoshop Okay, now afterwards I'm just I'm deleting this lock I'm duplicating this layer I'm not gonna do a keyboard shortcuts because um, I'm too lazy to edit later the effects that show the keyboards and everything <laughs> Okay so duplicate layer so we got this top layer now I like to add stars to my photos that, that's why I usually do so I want to add a few stars on top therefore I'm gonna go to Pexels um, it's an amazing stock photo site and I just write here stars so we got a really nice shot over here I'm just gonna download it and import it to my photo scale it so it will fit your scale it so it will fit what? So it will fit your photo and because we just need the stars. So we got the photo inside our project I'm just gonna change the blending mode to overlay. This is what I usually do um, Afterwards, I'm gonna do a mask of this layer. I'm gonna go to gradient and make sure it's on um, Yes, this thing and it's set to black so we can delete most of the part of the photos So usually the stars are somewhere over here um, And therefore I want to make it a bit rounded gradient deleted what stuff. Yeah, okay and yeah okay in my opinion it looks great uh, I'm a bit I think we can delete even a bit more okay yeah something like that so in my opinion it fits perfectly to here uh, maybe just a little change the opacity and maybe even add some birds um, just to add a bit of effect so we just go to Google and write them um, birds PNG this one looks very fine so I'm just gonna download this bird import them to my project add a few here so i want to spread them across the picture so i'm just gonna select some of them and layer via copy i'm gonna take these birds put them somewhere here the other ones i'm just gonna leave here make a mask from that and delete the birds that got inside on top of her because maybe we'll see them later in the edit and we don't want that yeah 
Sorry, I'm a bit, okay, I can't focus and talk at the same time to the camera because I'm a boy, okay, I can't do two things at the same time, I'm not a woman, it's hard for me, so I'm trying my best to talk to you and as well as edit, so yeah, um, I got the idea over here, um, the birds look dope in my opinion, maybe make them a bit slow, smaller because they look a bit huge. Okay, so we got this picture, um, it's, it looks nice, but it's not the final product because we're gonna import that to Lightroom and afterwards edit the color. So, we're just gonna click save as, hit JPEG, um, let's say dope as, sorry, um, I know the channel is PG-13, but sorry about this kid's picture. Okay, so we got the edit picture over here and let's just import it to Lightroom, I got my Lightroom over here, hit, click on library. And after we'll just take the picture, drop it in the library, and click import. Okay, so what I'm gonna do right now. So in most of my pictures, I make my own preset. I got my own preset pack, so I'm gonna show you how my preset pack looks. Here's my preset pack. I got you one, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah, okay, so I got your six pre uh, preset packs, and in all of my photos, I use the same preset packs, like one of these six. Some of my presets looks like better on specific photos, and some not. So I'm just using all of them and checking them all out in my pictures. I'm not gonna show you the entire preset because you know it's my preset. But if you want it, guys, um. I'm gonna put a link down below for you to buy my preset. Seven dollars is okay. So if you want this preset pack, uh, you can buy it for seven dollars from the link in the description below. You got, you can get, you will get that. You um, you had, you 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 could you do. You will get all my six presets that I always use in my pictures, and my favorite one that I'm using exactly right now. It's called Sunset Vibes. And it just adds a lot of color and change the colors of the sky and makes it a little bit more vibey and the temperature is a bit hot and cold like I don't know it's great and it also has grain in it and fade colors and I really like it so in my opinion it looks great I think I'm just gonna add a bit of fade over here you know what never mind it looks doper <laughs> it looks okay just like that if you want you can change the colors of the sky but I like them as they look right now but you just go to the blue and change the colors of the sky so this is the perfect match for me and yeah the preset did everything and I love this preset so if you want to get all my six preset packs that I always use in my photos um, You can buy it in the link below as I already said You probably came to this video from my Instagram account But if not, here's the link to my Instagram account You can see all of my photos over there In all of them you will see that I'm using the, almost the same exact preset pack From my Lightroom that I made by myself And yeah, that's basically it So I'm just gonna click export We got the picture ready and it looks amazing in my opinion I really liked it and it just was an easy fast edit that I did for the vlog But it looks dope and I'm gonna post it soon Moreover, you can check out other photos that I use with the same preset pack sunset vibes from the photo shoot without editing the photos like without editing the stars or the birds just as they should be with only the preset pack and they also look nice in my opinion yeah guys if you want to achieve these results in your pictures and like get the colors that I have in my pictures then just go and buy my preset pack and let me know what you think of that I would really appreciate it if you even send me some of your pictures using my preset it will be really nice and I'll give you a shout out in my Instagram account I hope this video helped you a bit and uh, you understood better how I edit my pictures how I edit the birds and the stars that I always put in my pictures yeah guys that was the vlog I'm just super super busy I'm doing a lot of stuff because of school and editing and uh, I'm just making excuses but yeah I got stuff to do okay I got a life so guys I hope you enjoyed this video if you did please make sure to leave a like and subscribe if you're new write down in the comments below what you think of this video if you want to see more tutorials or thank you so much for watching guys I just hit 4600 subscribers and it's just amazing so I thank you all for your support love you all I was Elie Vox and I'll see you tomorrow with a new smile Peace.